Good afternoon, Sean. Yeah, that's correct. And that list expected to grow as the ripple effects of those canceled flights begins to spread. Now, this morning we spoke with some passengers who consider themselves very fortunate to get out ahead of that blizzard. At the Manchester Boston Regional Airport, the runways were clear and the planes were taking off without a problem. But the arrival and departure board gave hints of the problems down south. We were originally supposed to be on the 5 p.m. flight this afternoon, but when the winter weather warning uh, came out, uh, we, we called and immediately moved our flights up to uh, 7 a.m. The Keithleys and two other families are heading north from Baltimore to do some skiing. They consider themselves fortunate to get out ahead of the storm. The flight attendants told us that Originally, they had 55 passengers for the morning flight, and uh, a few hours later after the storm announcement, they uh, filled the plane. Every seat was taken. Feeling very grateful this morning. Southwest allowed us to rebook our flight from Sunday to this morning. Brenda Eastman is thankful to be back home in New Hampshire. She was visiting family in D.C. She says her family there was going through some rituals that are very familiar to Granite Staters. You know, purchasing batteries, the prospect of power outages, um, schools shut down. We play on Sunday, but because of the weather, we had to fly up today. It's the only way we could get out and play, so we're here early. The University of Maryland, Baltimore County has a basketball game in Vermont. Allen says that the scheduling department rebooked them a few days ago, so their game will go on. And while the NFC championship game will also go on, the departure board had some bad news for fans of the Carolina Panthers or Arizona Cardinals. For Pats fans, it doesn't look like their flights to Denver will be impacted unless you have to connect through a mid-Atlantic state. Other than that, though, it should be game on for the Pats, and we'll have more on cancellations as we go throughout the day. Reporting live, Manchester Boston Regional Airport, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.